Welcome to The Secret Tech Hacks. In today's video, I'll be covering the seven AI tools I use daily to boost productivity, simplify workflows, and automate those tedious tasks that eat up too much of our time. With AI, we're beyond the hype now. We don't want cool tech demos that look good on paper. We want real, practical tools we can use every day, and that's exactly what this list is about. Plus, if you stick around, I've got five bonus tools that, while I don't use them daily, are incredibly useful and might be perfect for your needs. So let's dive in. First up, Arc Browser and Perplexity. If you haven't tried Arc, this browser is an entirely fresh take on how we interact with the web. Two features that immediately stand out, the vertical sidebar for organizing tabs and bookmarks, and the split view option for multitasking. The vertical sidebar is perfect if you tend to take on how to open lots of tabs. It keeps everything tidy without that chaotic row of tiny tabs up top. And for even more organization, there's a clever AI-powered feature, the broom button. When things get messy, just click it, and it'll sort and group your tabs automatically. A unique feature I love is the split view. Just drag a tab out, and it'll auto-split your screen, adjusting as you go. This is perfect if you're working across two or more resources, like like researching for a project or writing and referencing at the same time. Arc's integration with Perplexity is where it really shines. Perplexity is like a personal research assistant. It searches the web, gathers the best answers, and presents everything concisely without ads. Let's say I need to research something quickly, like the key benefits of Arc Browser. Perplexity will pull all relevant information into a digestible format, along with links to the sources. It's faster and more accurate than typical search engines because it uses retrieval augmented generation, reducing errors by verifying info from multiple sources. If you're curious, Perplexity also offers a paid version with access to advanced language models. It's handy if you want to switch between different AI options like GPT-4, Claude, and more, but I find the free version covers my needs. Next, let's talk about Notion, the central hub. If you're looking for a digital workspace to store everything, Notion is the way to go. Think of it as your second brain, the central place where you store and organize all your information. Notion keeps everything in one place, which is key to staying productive. Let me walk you through my setup. I've organized my workspace into sections, AI tools, content creation, to-dos, resources, and even critiques from viewers. When I come across new AI tools or video ideas, I store them here in an AI knowledge base section. For example, I recently came across an AI avatar tool that I want to explore, but I didn't have time to test it right then, so I saved it in Notion with notes on what I want to check out later. What's really powerful is Notion's flexibility. I can organize video scripts, add checklists for different stages of content creation, and make notes on sponsors and ideas. Plus, Notion has its own built-in AI tools. I can highlight a passage and have it reformatted into bullet points or even generate analogies if I need one. Notion's AI integrations and customization options make it invaluable, especially when you're juggling lots of projects. The method Managing Messages with Text.com and Missive for Me, managing messages from different social media accounts used to be a huge time sink, between Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, and Discord, it was easy to lose track of conversations or waste time scrolling through feeds. EnterText.com. Text.com pulls all your social media messages into one unified inbox. So now instead of checking each app separately, I block out a dedicated time to handle all my messages at once. This not only saves me time, but also keeps me from getting distracted by social feeds. And since it's all private, end-to-end -end encrypted, I know my data is secure. When it comes to email, Missive is my go-to. Missive has a unique team collaboration feature that makes it easy to share email drafts and prompts making it great for people who collaborate with others on projects. It integrates with OpenAI so you can draft emails quickly, correct grammar, translate, and even use custom AI prompts. This has completely changed great how I handle email, allowing me to get to inbox zero faster than ever. The ultimate design tool, Canva, is a lifesaver for creating anything design-related. Social media graphics, presentations, infographics, and more, it's all here. 
Let's say I'm working on a video about AI tools and need graphics to make it visually engaging. Canva, I can pull together a design within minutes that would otherwise take hours in Photoshop. What makes Canva even more powerful are its AI-driven tools. For example, if I need a template in a specific size, Canva's AI will resize it automatically to the best aspect ratio. It's easy to edit images with the Magic Eraser tool, resize or replace elements, and create templates from text prompts. It's fast, intuitive, and lets you make high-quality designs on a budget. My brainstorming partner, ChatGPT. Many of you are probably already familiar with ChatGPT. It's my go-to tool for brainstorming. If I'm stuck or need ideas, I can prompt ChatGPT to give me suggestions, review my script, or even offer critiques. I use it not just to generate ideas, but to refine them. Often, just reading through ChatGPT's suggestions sparks even more ideas that I wouldn't have considered on my own. Beyond brainstorming, I use ChatGPT for a thousand other tasks. Bonus tools, five hidden gems. Here are five more AI tools I highly recommend. I don't use these every day, but they're incredibly useful. Forms.app. If you ever need to make a quick survey or quiz, Forms.app is amazing. I can make a polished, branded form within minutes. Whether it's for customer feedback or a fun quiz, it's fast, customizable, and easy to embed on websites. Otter.ai. This is an AI meeting assistant that records and transcribes your meetings. You can search by keywords, jump to different points in the transcript, and review key points afterward. If you have frequent meetings, Otter is invaluable because it lets you focus on the conversation instead of taking notes. Humata, think of Humata as a research companion. It's great for analyzing complex documents by summarizing and highlighting key points. This is incredibly useful if you work with lengthy research papers, contracts, or technical documents. I can quickly extract what I need, saving hours of reading time. Gamma, this tool lets you create presentations, documents, and even full web pages with AI. All the text and images can be generated from scratch, and you can customize everything to your liking. It's a fantastic solution for those who don't have design or coding experience but need a quick, professional-looking web presence. Bonus, bonus, Futurepedia. Finally, if you're looking to discover more AI tools and trends, head over to futurepedia.com. It's a directory that highlights new and noteworthy AI tools each week, so you can stay updated on the latest innovations. You can even sign up for their newsletter to receive AI news, tools, and tutorials right directory that hide in your inbox. And that wraps up our list. Thank you so much for watching today's video on productivity boosting AI tools. Be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and let me know in the comments which tool you're excited to try out or if there's one I missed that you think deserves a shout out. I'll see you in the next video.